Pilates, Pilates, Pilates. Just about everyone at the moment seems to be doing Pilates, so of course I thought why not try Pilates for two weeks to see if I do get any results or any benefits from doing Pilates. This is me, AK Renee, and if you're also uncoordinated like me, also wanting to start Pilates, this video is definitely for you. Hi, hello, and welcome back to another video. As you can all see from the title and thumbnail of this video, we are going to be attempting Pilates. Unless you've all been living under a rock for like the last few months, all know about Pilates. I've literally seen it all over my TikTok. No, previously I was doing Daisy Keach's Hourglass Abs Workout. I really wanted to focus my overall fitness level. So then I decided, why not try Pilates? Let's be honest, your girl hasn't been to the gym in two years. I really don't want to have to get another membership. I'll be doing Pilates Pilates for at least two weeks every single day so I can give an honest review. If I've noticed any changes, what my body is currently looking like, I'm not actively trying to lose weight or anything like that, but I just wanted to show you a starting point and reference. Just wanted to say the only reason I've decided to do Pilates, I have had some serious chronic fatigue over the last year as you might already know, and I've really struggled to lift weights. So I thought Pilates seems like a really good, I wanna say easy because it's definitely not easy, of movement to try and get my body back into some regular exercise routine. Currently lost all of my strength, probably have the strength of a five-year-old at the moment. Actually can't even lift five kilo weights without wanting to nap for three hours. So this is going to be very interesting. And before I do demonstrate with you all a very intense Pilates workout in my lounge, I just wanted to say a big thank you to Chatspin for kindly sponsoring today's video. Chatspin is an app that allows you to connect with people from all over the world. And some of you may or may not know that I am moving within the next few months. So this is going to be great for me to be able to use this app to connect and meet new people. The best thing that I like about this app is that it doesn't cost anything to join. This app is such a great way to meet new people. When is the last time you met a new friend? Especially if you're an adult, it is really hard to make new friends or maybe that's just me. So I'm really excited to start using Chatspin, especially when I do move. If you'd like to know more information about Chatspin or to download the app, I've left a link in the description of this video for you guys if you would like to try. 12 seconds later. Okay guys, it is time now to do this Pilates workout. My main goal with doing Pilates is just to get back all my strength that I have lost and I'm really excited to get strong again. Instead of doing my normal YouTuber workouts, I did decide to get a membership for online Pilates classes, which I 10 out of 10 recommend. I had so much more structure when I was doing my workouts. Struggled in just about every single online class I did. Let me tell you guys the ban. The ban in my abs was absolutely on fire with this exercise. It's at this exact moment that I literally had instant regrets that I decided to wear a jumper to this Pilates workout. What was I thinking, guys? I was literally dripping in sweat. I really enjoy these sort of exercises where you don't have to do anything. Okay, now moving on to the next exercise. All I can say is that this exercise really tested my coordination skills or lack thereof. I really struggled to do this. Just when I thought things possibly couldn't get any more complex, this exercise decided to appear next. This was by far the longest 15 minutes of my life. Every single second was excruciating pain in my midsection. At this exact moment that I contemplated quitting, I really just wanted to give up at this point, go back to my comfort zone of the couch, eat some more chocolate, but no, we're not quitters here on this channel. We get back up even if we fall down again and again. So I don't know why I had it in my head that people just kept saying that Pilates was like stretching. Pilates is not stretching. I am in excruciating pain every single second during this workout. sure why but I felt like I was swimming minus the swimming pool with this manoeuvre. It was very very intense and my shoulders were very sore afterwards. Just take a minute to appreciate the stretching breaks during a Pilates workout but in my opinion they're definitely not long enough and oh my goodness look at my hair guys. For reference I never tie my hair up when I exercise and I actually have no idea why because that is definitely not normal. Now it is time for relaxation Pilates.
I enjoyed those two minutes of relaxation, but now it is time to get back to business. I finally decided to take my jumper off and get straight into some planks, which was very challenging and I hated every second of it. I just skip doing the planks and <laughs> yay, what do you know? The workout is finally complete. Yay. A few moments later. I was so incredibly hungry. I had leftover chicken stir fry and it was so delicious, guys. I need to drop this recipe because it was so tasty. One week later. Halfway through doing this Pilates every day. I don't really want to call it a challenge because we want to implement doing Pilates long term. I can say guys is I've never felt so much pain in all my existence. Pain literally in every single muscle in my body. Point where I've got muscles that I didn't even know existed because now they're hurting and... That is all I can say. Pilates is definitely not easy if you were doing the right workouts. In terms of what I'm eating, nothing has really changed. I do have some what I eat in a day videos on my channel. I did just end up finishing off an entire block of chocolate because chocolate is life. We eat chocolate every single day here on this channel. A reminder, I've not gone on a diet to do this challenge. I repeat, I've not gone on a diet to do this challenge. I'm still eating my mm, delicious cake every single week, multiple times a week, if I'm being totally honest honest with you all. Three days later. I'm sorry, the old Renee can't come to the phone right now. She's too busy being a Pilates girl. Guys, my coordination skills has improved so much after the last two weeks. So it is now currently the end of me attempting Pilates every single day for two weeks. And all I can say, guys, is that I am currently Pilates obsessed. I think that Pilates is super easy to do. Definitely not because... The girl struggled in just about every single Pilates class that I did online over the last two weeks. I am also going to be continuing Pilates. I've done it for a two week challenge does not mean that I'm going to stop. Sure, I'm definitely not going to be doing it every single day because I definitely do need to have some breaks. We'll be doing Pilates consistently every single week, whether that's two or three classes a week online or whether I do decide to take the plunge into doing actual Pilates classes such as reformer Pilates. Pretty sure I need to work on my balancing skills before I decide to sign up to any reformer Pilates classes. So it is now the moment of truth what you've all been waiting for. It is finally time to share my before and after from doing Pilates. Quick disclaimer, not attempt to lose weight at all for this challenge. I really just wanted to feel more stronger, have more structure when it came to my workouts. Anything else, definitely just a bonus. I'd be seeing you all scroll over just so you can watch the before and after. This is what I was looking like before I started any Pilates. My goal was just to get stronger. I honestly really didn't care about having abs because I just wanted to be so strong that I can lift all my groceries in from the car into the house in one trip, guys. One eternity later. Oh my goodness, two weeks of Pilates every single day and all I can say is why have I not decided to do this sooner? Included both relaxed and flexing because I think that's super important. But seriously, guys, I'm Pilates obsessed. I'm going to continue doing Pilates I've honestly enjoyed it. Another big thank you to Chatspin for kindly sponsoring this week's video. I have left a link in the description if you would like to check out the app. And I'll see you guys all in my next video.